My name is Sarah Waiswa. I am a portrait and documentary photographer from Kampala, Uganda, but based in Nairobi, Kenya. Um, photography is very important for me uh, to tell a story. I've had people say, oh, my daughter saw your photos and was really interested and she had never really heard about albinism before and so she wanted to know more about it. For a stranger in a familiar land, I came across an article that was talking about how people with albinism were being persecuted in certain parts of sub-Saharan Africa. And, you know, it talked about a lot of witchcraft and them being kind of harmed for their body parts. And, you know, the, the image kind of that I conjured in my mind was, was really a vivid one. I came across the ballet in Kibera story through the news. When you think about, you know, a large informal settlement, you're not thinking about ballet. And so immediately I was, I was really interested in that juxtaposition. I like the one with where the girls are standing with their, um, with their arms up. But I also like the one with the boys, where um, one of the boys is holding the other boy's leg up because that class was mostly girls and they were in there just as much um, enjoying the space and the dance as the girls were. So I think that was also an interesting image for me. I was uh, doing a residency in the Congo, in Lubumbashi, and I noticed how people there are extremely, extremely religious. And I asked my friend, who do they belong to? And he said, oh, they, you know, those are the Kimbanguists. And then he began to, to tell me the history of them. I hadn't really heard of any other religion that kind of worshipped a black Jesus. And so I think that's, that's why it was interesting for me. I don't have a photography background, but it is my passion, um, and I'm so glad that I followed it. And I would just encourage young women particularly to follow their dreams and to let their voices be heard and to tell their stories. <laughs>